Dina. Hi. You guys look such like the happy, smiling couple. <laughs> I know. Are you guys husband and wife? Yes. yes. And how long have you been married? Five years. Husband and wife sometimes start to look alike. We've get gotten it a lot. that. We you get, get that a lot. lot. If I didn't know you guys, I think you were massive narcissists. No, so yeah. I'll tell you why. Because <laughs> you end up hooking up someone else that looks just like you. <laughs> <laughs> Terry would absolutely marry himself if he could. Flex, let me see you flex. You'll go in looking like this and come out looking like this. <laughs> <Good>. Stop. <laughs> What is there to look at here? How many years ago did you have your breast done? 18. OK, oh. 18 years ago. When was the first one? 2002. I was 23 years old. I'd always wanted, like, a really, really nice chest. I've definitely always had a fascination with big breasts. But all the way through high school, I was flat chested. And we all watched Baywatch. So I've always wanted that Pamela Anderson look. How did that go? So there was only two plastic surgeons in town. So I chose the doctor without the consultation fee. That was it. We've heard that before. Yes. That yeah. happens all the time. A free consultation. Well, there's a reason why it's free. Is the doctor not busy, unexperienced, doesn't get great results? Beware of the doctor that does not charge a consultation fee. So how many CCs was put in? 650. You were pretty happy. Oh, I was very happy. Happy for how long? What happened? <laughs> one year, almost to the day, one popped while I was vacuuming. So what did you do? 2005, back to the same one. Okay. Got my surgery. A week later, this side was just mostly red. This side was starting to look infected. So I called his office and he said he was a week out. He didn't say come right in? Mm -mm. And knowing that you may have an infection. Dina had very early post-operative redness. That is almost a surgical emergency and is absolutely not something that can wait a week out. Two days before my appointment, mm. felt sick. Mm. This one was pussing really, 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 really bad. Oh and it's I over. went into the ER. Yeah, it's over now. They have to come out, I bet. Mm -hmm. Okay. He had taken out a lot of tissue on the underside on both of them. After I woke up from the anesthesia, both of my breasts were gone. I was left with just the top half of my breast, essentially. So now you've got distorted, deflated breasts with no mm -hmm. implants. How long did you live with that for? Three years. Three years, wow. Yeah. That must have been tough, huh? It really was. It really was. Shirts would, were not even allowed to touch the front of me. Like, it was 3XL large shirts. It was sweatshirts. There was no way I was going to be in a bathing suit. Right. Mm. In 2008, my mom said that she was going to pay for me to get them done again. Yeah. She vetted the other doctor, the one with... The consultation fee. The one with the consultation <laughs> fee. To just put implants back in. How'd they look? Better. But he said that they would drop down. And it just didn't happen. Because of Dina's horrible complication from her infection and the fact they removed most of her lower breast tissue, unfortunately and not surprisingly for Dina, just slapping in a pair of breast implants is not going to fix her distortion at all. OK, so when you guys met, you had this phenomenon going mm -hmm. on. Were you a little self-conscious about him seeing it? He doesn't see it. What do you mean he doesn't see it? I still don't. It, it's hard because her confidence is down and everything. I'm like, let's get you feeling how you should feel. Like, there's no showers together. I don't even like to look at myself naked in the mirror. I want to look good. I want to be normal husband and wife. I want to I wanna come in being all sexy and cute. He treats me like I'm the most beautiful person that's ever walked this planet. And that's the way I want to feel. And the only reason I don't feel this way is because of the way my breasts currently look like. So are you still wanting to be Pam Anderson kind of sized? I mean, I love the big breasts. I'm not sure that's possible. The answer lies in the examination room. 